Hi everyone, my name is Sajid Ngesh, and I'm a student at Silicon Valley for you. I currently attend their ProCoders class, which is teaching me how to use Angular and Ionic to build mobile and web applications. I'm currently working on a project, which is a marketplace for booking vacations. Booking vacations is a long process, which takes many, many hours. And it's just a real waste of time as you're scouring through multiple websites trying to see what the best deals are. And if you want to buy a house, you may have to go to Airbnb. And if you want to buy or rent a hotel, you may have to go to Trivago or Booking.com. Well, going through all these sites, you have to scour multiple times to try to find the best deals. Well, I built a website that has it all. Apartments, houses, and hotels all in one page so you don't have to go through all the other sites trying to compare deals you can just make make a deal on on my website i built this website using angular and ionic and i also used google maps api and firebase i'm planning on using more apis as i continue finishing up the website let me show you the website so this is my website and once you join the website you'd be redirected to this login page. And usually you would sign up, but I already have an account. And But if you sign up, your credentials get securely saved in Firebase. So now I can just log in. So if I log in with my current credentials, it should allow me in. All right, now the password. For this website, the password has to be at least six characters long. And yeah, now I can log in. Now it's checking with Firebase if the credentials are correct. And they are. So now it redirects me to this page with the map that's loading. It'll show where I'm located right now, which is correct. And I can also search for other areas. So let's just say I search for Target. Okay. So, as people add new offers, new pins will show up on the map, showing where those hotels, houses, or apartments are. And for, and for people to add offers, I'm currently working on a page, which will allow them to add if it's a hotel, apartment, or a house. And they can add pictures and a short description about it, add the price, and add the location. And if they submit that, it'll automatically update this map and show where it is. But it's still a work in progress. I'm also working on another page, which will allow people to pay for the actual venue they chose. So if I chose a hotel, I could just pay for it using a payment gateway. But those are future steps. So I used, I used Firebase because it's very reliable and safe. And I know my my data is going to be safe in there, and nobody can hack it or steal it. I also chose Google Maps API because it's easy to use, and it's very reliable, and has good locations. And yeah, so this is why I chose to do this project, and this is where the project is right now. Thank you for listening.